What's going on guys? So I just want to give y'all a quick word of encouragement um, about purpose, about, about your purpose in life. There was a story that I read a while back and, and I am so grateful for God for, for putting this story in my life. Um, and, and I just want to share this story with y'all. It's super short and it's about a man named Edward Kimball. Edward Kimball was a salesman and he was also a Sunday school teacher. Well one day Edward Kimball led a man named Dwight Moody to Christ. And Dwight Moody went on to lead one million people to Christ in his short lifetime. And one of those one million people was a man named Wilbert Chapman. Wilbert Chapman went on to be, to be an amazing evangelist also. And Wilbert Chapman's assistant was a man named Billy Sunday. He was a baseball player. And he was also a drunk be, before being converted to Christ. But check this out. Billy Sunday gathered these Christian congressmen in, in, in North Carolina as part of his ministry. And one of those Christian congressmen was a man named Mordecai Ham. And in 1934, Mordecai Ham witnessed to a young man named Billy Graham. I don't know if you know who Billy Graham is, but he was, an, he was used by God in an amazing way. Um, I looked up how many people Billy Graham witnessed to and, and preached to in his lifetime, and it was 215 million people in 185 countries and territories. And so I'm telling you all this, and, and I tell you that story to tell you this. There are people in your life right now are there's going to be people that step into your life that only you can reach for God. And I tell you that because check this out. That story, those millions upon millions upon millions upon millions of people that heard the gospel, it all goes back to that one Sunday school teacher being obedient to God. I bet you that, that Sunday school teacher, Edward Kimball, never thought the impact that it was going to have just by him witnessing to that young man. Uh, Dwight Moody. I bet you he never knew that it was going to snowball effect and just and just lead masses of multitudes of people to Christ. And so I want to tell you that, man, to tell you this. There, your purpose is, is so great. I, I, I posted it a while back, man, how God, he doesn't leave people on this earth with no purpose. You have a purpose and your purpose is beyond your imagination. I promise you this. In this day and age with, with everything going on, with how negative and, and hateful this world is, this world needs to see a change. And I promise you, if you'll be obedient to God, if you'll let his purpose be done in your life, I promise you, you will be the change that this world needs to see. Don't believe me? Just ask Edward Kimball. I appreciate y'all watching.